Now it's time for the final step. Sorry. Hey guys, my name's Thomas, if you didn't already know, and if you did already know, welcome back. Um, you're probably wondering what my hair's doing in this big donut, but the truth is, I am shaving my face in today's video, and I have to pull my hair up anyway, and I just thought, why not do something outrageous, because that's totally me, in case you haven't already figured it out. Um, but yeah, <laughs> so welcome to this video. My face is way too bushy for uh, anything that I've ever wanted. Um, I just was experimenting with it, I wanted to see um, what I would look like with a big growth, and I'm not really a fan of it being this fluffy. I do like a little bit of chin hair, but today it is coming off. So where we start first, obviously I got this brand new uh, shaver. This is a Remington shaver. I got it yesterday in Big W for 26 bucks, and I mean, if you look at it, it's a cordless one, so it has rechargeable battery in it, which is great. Um, but not only that, it came with a thousand different heads. So here we've got a, uh, that's a lip one. I'm pretty sure that's for uh, your upper lip to get all the hairs off there. We've got a nose one, so when I get really old, if this thing lasts that long, it'll work for that. And I've also got like an actual beard trimmer, um, which I don't, I'm never really gonna use that one. I actually just solely purchased it for this head, but the cool thing is that you, they are interchangeable and they're very easy and self-explanatory. 26 bucks, I'm gonna try and find a link to it on Amazon, um, so you guys can go and get one if you wanna shop online. If you're in America, you probably don't have big W, so. I don't know, but this guy I'm looking really forward to using. Anyway, so after I use the beard trimmer, I'm kind of just gonna shave all the hair off my face. I kind of wanna keep the jawline, because if you notice, I haven't really got the best jawline. It kind of like is one big um, So <laughs> I'm gonna just shave all the hair off to a really short length, and then we're gonna go in cl with a close shaver, and just sort of take these parts off here and under here. So it kind of gives my face a more of a structured jaw, if you like. Without further ado, let's get into it and let's shave this motherfucking beard. Okay, so we're in the mirror, we're gonna use our um, Remington shaver just to take off all of this bulk. I'm just gonna give it one big shave um, and then, yeah, we'll go from there. All right, cool, see you in a minute. <laughs> Holy fucking molly. We already look so different, oh my gosh. Hey, <laughs> it actually feels so weird. This little blade though, this is a gun. I freaking love it. It took my hair off so quickly and so easily and I am super duper impressed. Oh my God, I'm so hairy. I just wanted to take a second to show you guys the actual hair that just fell off my face. Have a look at it. I don't know how many of you, this is gonna gross out, but three, two, one, ah, uh, yuck. Um, that all just came off my face. That is gross. Alright, ready for the next step. We're just gonna be, uh, oh, I keep wanting to look at the camera. We're just gonna be putting some water into the sink, dipping our brush and our soap um, in the water, making it nice and fluffy, and then going from there. my lip and my chin, see? And I've shaved under here, and I've shaved my cheek areas. I couldn't decide whether I wanted to take my lip hair off right now, or whether I was happy with it being that short. So I'm gonna wash all this soap off, have a look, and then make a decision. Okay, I'm back. Uh, I actually think the lip hair looks quite good. I actually underestimated the, um, the closeness of my new Remington razor. So it's actually cut this a little bit short and hasn't really left my jaw um, as pokey at as I probably wanted it to. Uh, but that's fine, like, because in the next couple of days this will be growing itself and I'll just have to continuously shave my neck under here. Um, yeah, I think it's good. I did, I think, leave a little bit of hair there. Can you see how long that is? I might have to shave that off. Let's shave that. No, 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 this guy one more time. All better. Now it's time for the final step. 
Sorry. <laughs> um, so the last product that I would use in my shaving routine um, are two new products that I've uh, been sent uh, by a company called Blavalair. Uh, they are the same makers as Starwax Pomade and stuff like that. And they've sent me um, to try out two of their uh, men's colognes. Now they called these colognes uh, in their email to me, but they're actually aftershave balms. So what they do is actually keep your skin nice and moisturized after you've, uh, you've shaved. Um, they're just so like, oh, you know, like that big beefy manly smell. <laughs> I actually really like it. So. Um, they're really beautiful. They've got two versions. They've got one called uh, Epsilon. Ta-da! If I get that will focus. And they've also got the other one called Sigma. Now, Sigma's the one that I've opened and liked the smell of the best. Oh, they're fucking so good. They're vegan, so they have they don't get tested on animals. There's no animal product in them. They're alcohol free. They're paraben free. Uh, I can't read that word. It's formulate something free. Sulfate free. Um, sodium chloride free. It's everything free, and it's still an amazing product. They're really good for if you get dry skin after you shave, which I'm pretty sure everybody does. Um, they're truly freaking amazing. So I just add a little tiny bit of Sigma on. That's the one that I'm using at the moment. Just go like that. Little tiny blob. I only need it for the parts where I shaved, um, which is, you know, my cheek area. Oh, fucking hell, it smells so good. I'm gonna leave links to these in the description below because I definitely recommend them, especially if you get a dry neck after shaving. Mm. Mm -mm. Anyway, let's have a look at the before and after shots of me uh, when I before I shaved and then now. I want you to tell me in the comment section below which you think looks better. Um, most people have said to me, when the fuck are you going to shave your face? So <laughs> I'm guessing everybody's going to say the shaven look looks better. But anyway, I'll let you be the judge. Personally, I think I look better with a shaven face, but it's totally up to me, right? It's my face, I get to wear it however I want. Um, but I still would like to know your opinion, so let me know in the comments section below. Um, if you did want to check out any of the products that I used in this video, oh, look at my leg. Um, if you <laughs> did want to check out any of the products in this video, I will leave links in the description below, so you can go and check all of them out. Um, and other than that, I hope you have a great day, and it was a pleasure making this video for you. <laughs> um, catch you later, and have a good week. Bye! <laughs> Okie dokie, let's take you off that camera stand and show you what's in my grooming drawer. So, um, our grooming drawer is the second drawer down. Ta-da! Here is everything. Oh shit, I hit the tripod. Okay, this is everything that we have in the grooming drawer. Um, I'm going to start up at the back. Oops, come out a bit further. Fuck. Alright, cool. Um, we're going to start at the back here. So, up the back, we've got...